To connect the Google Pixel 9 Pro or 9 Pro XL to a Mac, laptop or computer, we want to head to this website here, android.com forward slash file transfer. Now the problem with this website is it used to have the Android file transfer app for Mac. They've now completely removed this one. And so instead, first of all, check if they bring it back because they should. If they don't bring it back, we're going to need to head to archive.org. So you see archive.org and then we see enter URL and we'll put that URL in android.com forward slash file transfer and we'll search for this one. So archive.org archives the older versions of websites. So we can view the older version of the Android file transfer. So I'm going to go to uh, we'll do February 2024 and we'll select a snapshot and we're just looking for a version of the website which has the Android file transfer download available. So we'll patiently wait for this to load. Archive.org is quite a slow website. And so it's loaded up the Android file transfer. You can see you know, browse and transfer files between Mac and Android. So we're going to download this one. You may have to go to multiple snapshots to actually find the download here. And then you see that download has uh, not worked. So we're going to need to patiently wait. And so it gave an error, but it's redirected me to the download. So I'll click on allow and then the download will start like this. So hopefully Google just adds back the download because the page they redirect you to is quick share for Windows but there's nothing for Mac, if that makes sense. So we need that Mac download. So once this is downloaded, set it up, and then in your applications, you should have the Android file transfer. It will be called the Android file transfer agent. And then we can open this one up like this. So the Android file transfer agent will automatically open when you connect the phone to the computer. There is something you have to do on the phone for it to actually detect. So after you connect the Google to your computer, I'm just using the USB-C charging cable. First requirements of two is if it says allow accessory, you will need to allow the accessory. And you can see it says can't access device storage, but it has opened up the Android file transfer app. So on the Google Pixel, what we need to do is swipe down from the top once, then we will see the USB charging this device. So we'll tap on this one, whatever it says with USB, and then we'll tap for more options. And so what we need to do is where it says no data transfer and use USB, we need to select this, use USB for file transfer slash Android Auto. And now you can immediately see my file system show up. That's great. You could do USB tethering if you want to do tether via USB. If you're still having issues, your cable doesn't support data transfer. So just find that cable inside your box and use that one instead.